destroyed each other. So we, yes, intellectually we can see beyond this, right? It's not difficult to see beyond it intellectually. But do we know it? And do we live according to our knowledge? This is another thing. But enlightenment comes to us, not we go to enlightenment. All your efforts to attain enlightenment will fail. If you're doing it with the idea of reaching enlightenment. So I don't think that enlightenment is only for Buddhists and Christians and Muslims cannot become enlightened. That's the wrong understanding. Buddhists. And what does it 
what happens when we call ourselves Buddhists? We separate ourselves from people who call themselves Christians, Muslims, Hindus, or whatever. And are we separate? Are we really different than other people? We must be careful with these names, because they blind us, prevent us from seeing. So, I mean, perhaps you, you were born into a Buddhist family, so you've just inherited Buddhism from your parents or grandparents, right? No? Well, I didn't. My parents are not Buddhists. So, why are we Buddhists? There must be a reason. You could be missing something better. Have you investigated Christianity and Hinduism and Islam? Perhaps they're better than Buddhism. Why don't you look? Don't be content with something second rate or, 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 or third rate or tenth rate if you can find something better. Obviously, anyone who follows any religion thinks that their religion is the best. Otherwise, they wouldn't follow it. How can they say that it is the best religion if they haven't investigated other religions? That would be silly, no meaning. We can say it is the best only if we have investigated other religions. If we've tested them and applied them. And we can say it is the best, perhaps, but only for oneself. This is the best way for me. You can't say it's the best way for anyone else. And it might be the best way for you only at a particular stage in your life. Maybe later you'll find something else and you'll change and say, oh, this is better than that was before. So we must be careful. These divisions cause a lot of trouble. People hate each other because of religion. Is this the purpose of religion? When it causes people to hate each other? And kill each other? Something is wrong. Again, know why you do what you do. Why you are what you are. And don't let anyone tell you the answers. You must find for yourself. you think, oh, what he's talking about tonight, oh, can't understand. Well, what would be the point of going to listen to a Dharma talk if you know everything already? That would be a waste of time. Surely you, you want to learn something that you do not yet know. Not just to go replaying the same old video over and over again. No point. So if it's hard to understand, it's good. Use your grey matter a bit. Think. Don't believe, but think. Don't say, oh, very difficult to understand. No point in trying to understand this. I think anyway we shall stop now. May I give you a blessing for New Year? Please, uh, may I have a glass of water and something to sprinkle it with?
every dancer. <laughs> Nothing at all. But if you don't call yourself anything at all, or you say, I don't know who I am, and if this appears stupid to other people, it will not be stupid to you, it will be honest. Because we really, really do not know who we are or what we are. And if we can say that sincerely, I don't know, then we can learn. Transformations like what happened to Cinderella, or you'll be disappointed. <laughs> 